What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. So, as usual, I have Hannah, and we have a special guest, the pumpkin guy. So, he's been down here hanging out with the 41 Dodge and just chilling with it. But in our last video, tell them about our last video, like the options we gave them and stuff like that. So, our last video, we asked you all, do you want to see us build the 41 Dodge? or the 58 Dodge, and that one's a D500, right? Yep. That one's a lot bigger than this one. And um, you all commented, we appreciate that. A lot of people said the 58, but a lot more people said the 41. So the only thing is we change our mind a lot, like I said, and um, we kind of... Yeah, we... we uh... We uh, switched gears on you guys. Yeah. Originally, we said we were going to uh, use this truck and the 97 Dodge extended cab truck that we call the Gold Nugget. Um, so it's a 97 Dodge with an automatic. The transmission's shot, but we we're going to build the transmission and set this thing on it. But we've we got something a little cooler for you. Actually, a lot cooler than the Gold Nugget. Um, well, yeah. We're excited to show you guys the donor truck. And um, is there anything else you would? like to say before we introduce the, the new donor truck for this project? So originally, if we built this truck, if we didn't fall in love with it, which I mean, we probably would, we, fall in love we were with going to ideas. sell it after we built it because, you know, it, it was just a gold nugget, didn't mean a whole lot to us, just whatever. Yeah. But new plans, we're not going to sell this. No, this. It is going to be... It'll be here forever. Pretty cool. So just... And I'm like, we're excited to uh, show you guys the new donor truck and to stop wasting your all's time. Let's let's drop this uh, new donor truck on them. What you guys just witnessed was Redemption, a 2011 Jeep Wrangler that we built probably four or five years ago whenever we were at, whenever I was at Weeds Off Road. So a little background, uh, my dad and my parents own Weeds Off Road and I recently in March left there to start my own company which is CWC and the Jeep's been great for us. We built this Jeep with um, at Weeds Off Road with our friends, family, Hannah, my dad, we all put a lot of time in this vehicle, but uh, to make things short, the direction that uh, CWC and the business Hannah and I are growing, um, we're going to a lot more uh, rat rod shows and stuff like that. And the Jeep is setting in a storage building. So we decided to put the 41 Dodge on Redemption's chassis. So that way we'll be able to take Redemption with us, not we'll be able to take it off-roading and also it'll be able to go with us to some of the rat rod shows and stuff like that so i love this jeep it's it's awesome like i'll give you guys a walk around real quick so to start off with under the hood okay well real quick it is sitting on a 2011 uh jeep regular frame it's been the frame which everyone says you can't put a cummins yeah. on a Wrangler frame. Well, guess you what? It's, we literally have been wheeling this for five years and nothing. Nothing. It's still straight. It's not bent. It's got Ford Super Duty axles under it. It's got a PSC hydro steering, 14 inch ORI struts. Under the hood, it's got a 12 valve Cummins out of a 97 Dodge. It's, uh, it's got a <laughs> built uh, transmission. It's got Moundoon Mound Dune internal parts inside of it. 42 inch Maxxis Trepador competition sticky tires, um, custom suspension. All right, I feel like I'm on MTV Cribs. So now to the inside, it's got a full <laughs> DOM cage, custom dash, transfer case. This runs the transmission, overdrive, torque converter lockup. It's a really- It's, it's a, a really, really cool Jeep. Yeah, it's, it's really, yeah, it's really nice, but I feel like, like I was saying earlier, just the direction that we're going with our company, um, the Jeep's not there. So if we switch the 41 body on it, 
it'll just open up a lot more opportunities. Well, so the only thing I'm struggling with is got the back seat. Yeah. So, um, I'm kind of really, I don't know. I'm not really upset, too upset about it because we don't really have too many people that go off-roading with us. But when we do, we always have a good time. And that was always a nice cooler space, just reach behind you. So we're gonna have to have a designated cooler spot in the truck for that. But um, I think we'll make it work. Um, hopefully our friends will understand and not give us too much grief because I really, really think that the 41 Dodge needs to be out in the woods and <laughs> doing what it should be doing. I mean, back in the day, I'm sure they took it on grass trails and <laughs> dirt trails. <laughs> so um, we're just gonna do that a little bit more extreme with it. Yep. conclude this video we appreciate you guys as always so don't forget to like comment and subscribe and we'll catch you guys on the next one <laughs>